The Callow Hill section of Philadelphia used to be a dominant industrial part of the city, but had fallen upon hard times once many of the businesses left. This, this neighborhood lacks infrastructure. Um, there are not bike lanes or bike racks. Uh, the street lights are pretty outdated. This was old industrial and parking, so it's not pedestrian scale. But recently, there has been a revitalization in the neighborhood, partly in thanks to the up-and-coming developer group, Arts and Crafts Holdings. We love creative businesses, right? That's our bread and butter. The design firms, the architecture firms. We love um, organizations that help benefit the community and really like to transform not only just certain neighborhoods, but all of Philadelphia. The neighborhood seems to have turned a corner to get back to the industry of old, with property sales tripling between 2010 and 2015. What stood out to me is like the renovation of existing space. So you have now like a lot more loft areas, um, more residential, a lot of mixed use uh, properties as well. The neighborhood is still one that is very much so in transition, but one thing that would help it, more foot traffic, which the viaduct park right behind me is supposed to bring, but that is still very much so under construction, set to be opened at the end of the spring of 2018. I think that's going to be a huge feature. It's going to you know, bring a lot more people to come check out what Philadelphia's history is and like what it's going to in the future. You look around this area, it's old, industrial, cement, pavement, and this will offer some really amazing green space for people to have recreation opportunities that otherwise don't have it. Reporting in Callow Hill for Philadelphia Neighborhoods, I'm Jonathan Gilbert.